Hey everyone, welcome back to FX Limit, your go-to channel for all things Forex trading. In today's video, we're diving into the top 5 technical indicators you can use when trading in a range-bound market. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just getting started in Forex, range-bound markets can be tricky to navigate. But with the right tools and indicators, you can make some solid gains even when the market isn't trending. So stick around, because I'm about to reveal the best indicators to help you maximize your range-bound trading strategy. Alright, let's kick things off with one of the most commonly used indicators for range-bound markets. The Relative Strength Index, or RSI for short. RSI is a momentum oscillator that measures the speed and change of price movements. It moves between 0 and 100, with levels above 70 typically considered overbought and levels below 30 considered oversold. In a range-bound market, RSI can help you identify when prices are likely to reverse. When the RSI is over 70, it's often a good time to consider selling, while an RSI below 30 might signal a buying opportunity. This makes RSI perfect for identifying potential reversal points when prices are bouncing between support and resistance levels. Next up is the Bollinger Bands Indicator. Bollinger bands consist of three lines, a simple moving average in the middle, with an upper and lower band that track price volatility. In a range-bound market, the price tends to move within these bands, and the upper and lower bands act as dynamic support and resistance levels. The beauty of Bollinger bands in range trading is that when the price hits the upper band, it often indicates overbought conditions, signaling a potential short trade. When the price hits the lower band, it could indicate oversold conditions, signaling a potential long trade. This helps you time your entries and exits more precisely. Now, let's talk about Stochastic Oscillator. Similar to RSI, the Stochastic Oscillator helps you identify overbought and oversold levels, but with a little more nuance. The Stochastic Oscillator moves between 0 and 100, just like RSI, but it consists of two lines the percent %K and the percent %D lines. When these lines cross in the overbought or oversold region, it gives a stronger indication of a potential reversal. For range-bound markets, this indicator is especially useful because it helps confirm when the price is likely to reverse direction at the top or bottom of the range. Alright, indicator number 4 is the Average True Range, or ATR. ATR measures market volatility and is often used to set stop losses and take profits. In range-bound trading, ATR can give you a better sense of how much room the price has to move before it reverses. A low ATR suggests a tight range, while a higher ATR indicates more volatility. You can use this to your advantage by adjusting your targets and stops based on the current market conditions. When trading in a range, the ATR helps ensure your stops and profits are placed just outside the range to capture as much of the move as possible without getting stopped out too early. Now, before we move on to the last indicator, let's take a moment to introduce a tool we've developed at FX Limit, the Apex Trend Indicator. Although it's primarily designed to identify trending markets, this tool can also be quite useful in range-bound trading. Why? Well, the Apex Trend Indicator comes with a trend scanner that helps you quickly spot when the market transitions from trending to range-bound. This means you can adapt your strategy in real-time without missing out on any opportunities. Plus, it has built-in alerts for buy and sell signals, making it easy to execute your trades even if you're away from the charts. So if you're looking for a versatile indicator that works in both trending and range-bound conditions, the Apex Trend Indicator might be worth adding to your trading toolbox. Alright, moving on to our fifth and final indicator, and this one's a classic. The Moving Average Convergence Divergence, or MACD. While MACD is often used to spot trends, it can also be very effective in range-bound markets, especially when combined with other indicators like RSI or Bollinger Bands. MACD consists of two lines, the MACD line and the signal line, as well as a histogram that shows the difference between them. In a range-bound market, the MACD can help you identify when the momentum is shifting, even if the price is still moving sideways. This gives you an early heads-up on potential reversals, helping you time your trades more accurately. So there you have it. Those are the top 5 technical indicators for trading in a range-bound market. The RSI, 
Bollinger Bands, Stochastic Oscillator, ATR, and MACD. Each of these indicators brings something unique to the table, and when combined, they can give you a solid edge in range-bound conditions. Remember, every trader is different, so it's important to find the indicators that fit your style. And if you're looking for a powerful all-in-one solution, don't forget to check out the Apex Trend Indicator from FX Limit. It's a great tool for both trending and range-bound markets, and with features like real-time alerts and multi-timeframe support, it can really help you stay ahead of the game. Thanks for watching, and if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to FX Limit for more Forex trading tips and strategies. See you in the next video, and happy trading!